Australia is really, really well placed in quantum. We are one of the you know, top six countries in the world. We've invested in quantum research for many, many years. And what we're now seeing is the potential to take that fundamental research and turn it into the benefit for Australia. And this is so exciting because we're seeing it from that idea where it's a glint of some smart person's idea and measuring the world and understanding the world around us. But then we're able to turn it into application that can benefit everybody. The main ways that we search beneath the surface is usually by using geophysical techniques, but in some cases geochemical techniques, but mostly geophysics. And from that we develop a compelling argument to then start to drill holes. The thing with drilling, the deeper you go, and, and especially into frontier areas, the more risk that there is about the money that you're spending or, or the, you know, the investment you're putting into it and what you might get back on that. If we can make more efficient decisions using a bigger and better suite of data, then that will, that will change the equation for how we can look beneath the surface. And that's a big thing that quantum technologies offer. All of the energy and water use really comes from the fact that the minerals need to be crushed and processed. It's not actually from digging them out of the ground. So if it was possible to be able to understand what the grade of the ore was on a conveyor belt between the mine and the processing plant, in real time, if you like, then that could really influence the way you process and therefore save huge amounts of water and energy in that sort of extraction of the minerals. If you think of um, the changing landscape, the ESG concerns are growing. Uh, we have uh, more challenge around land access, our licenses license to operate that is getting harder as well. So, you know, the less drilling we can do and use technologies to see and understand the deposit and get the properties as much as we can. And finally, one day, if we can move uh, to the phase of, you know, drill to uh, verify rather than to drill to define, that would be just fantastic.